Really, this is one thing that's really holding back virtual reality from becoming popular. We made this simulation and it was tested quite truthfully uh, or truly in English, how do you say it, uh, by multiple different users for different segments of life, you know, young, old, game or not and so on. And uh, there was like serious problems of um, interacting with the world around them. And this is what is killing VR, you know, not this controller or perhaps it's a controller, but, you know, pressing these buttons, you know, grabbing and then understanding when it's trying to be real and not trying to be real when it's just clicking forward and when you really have to do something like aim deal time after time complaints about you know it doesn't stay in the hand you know that it, it uh, you, you don't know what to do and we are very confused that how far do you really need to take it that people can really use this type of simulations until they are not simulations anymore, you are just clicking forward, click, 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 click. Even now it's highly gamified that it's like a bit too easy even to do, in my perspective. But really, this is in virtual reality. We've been doing this since 2016 or whatever, and still it's causing problems with people to really have intuitive navigation in there. Yeah, we could just do it that click and everything happens, but you know, it doesn't make any sense then to have it in virtual reality. You could just have it on 2D screen and just click forward. So what do you think?